Welcome to our Tech Tips video. Today, we're tackling a question that many developers encounter while using Git and Vim. Our viewer is curious about how to limit the subject line of their Git commit messages to 50 characters. This practice is gaining traction in the developer community as it helps keep commit messages concise and readable. Let's dive into the specifics of the question and explore how to achieve this in Vim. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to say just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on. To limit the subject line of your git commit message to 50 characters in Vim, we need to adjust our Vim configuration. Let's start by opening your .vimrc file. Next, we will add an auto command that sets the text width for git commit messages. This will help us enforce the 50 character limit for the first line. Now, we also want to ensure that subsequent lines are wrapped at 72 characters. We can achieve this by adding another line to our vimrc. With these settings, the first line will automatically wrap at 50 characters, and any additional lines will wrap at 72 characters. This helps maintain a clean commit message format. Alternatively, if you want to highlight any text beyond the 50th character on the first line, you can use a different approach. This will visually indicate when your header is too long. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To limit the subject line of your git commit message to 50 characters, you can use Vim's auto commands. Set up a group called git setup and create an auto CMD for git commit file types. This will adjust the text width based on the line number. The logic behind this is straightforward. If the cursor is on the first line, the text width is set to 50 characters, otherwise it's set to 72. You can also create a local function for better organization. Additionally, the default git commit.vim syntax file highlights the first 50 characters as a keyword. You can modify this behavior to show errors for lines exceeding 50 characters by adding a highlight link. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your questions, and hopefully found that solution you're looking for. If we did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Thank <laughs> you.